thinking of becoming a UI UX designer in 2025? Well, you are on the right track. But before you jump into it, you must understand that businesses and brands these days are not just looking for great visuals. They need something seamless, intuitive experiences users actually love to interact. It's not just about how a product looks. It's about how it feels, flows and functions for the user. So, whether you are starting from zero or trying to switch your career in design, this video is for you. I'll be showing you exactly how to get into UI UX designing field the smart way. What tools to use, what mindset to follow and a brief roadmap. So, let's get started. First of all, I would like you to understand the difference between UI and UX. UI, user interface, this refers to the visual appearance of things. Things like uh, buttons, typography, layout, colors, images, etc. Whereas UX, user experience, is about how things work. It's about the structure, navigation, flow and functionality. So now that you have understood the difference, let's move to the next section. Tools These are the tools that you would need at a, as a UI UX designer in 2025. This is a simple toolkit with cleaner and simple approach. You can choose Figma, the industry standard for interface design and prototype. It's browser-based, beginner-friendly and packed with collaboration features and yes, it has a solid free plan. The next tool is FigJam. It is FigJam's whiteboarding is a perfect sidekick. It is ideal for brainstorming, wireframing, mapping, and other user flow activities that you can use. You can use this tool with a team or as a solo. The next tool is Notion, Milanote or Google Docs. You can use these tools for organizing your research work, documenting strategy, brand approach and keeping your process crystal clear. Apart from these, you can also use Adobe Illustrator for your designing purpose. It will help you with designing and visual aspect of the website or application. And finally, you should have an open mind. No tool replaces empathy, curiosity and the ability to listen to your clients. Now, let's move to another section, the learning part. After knowing the essential tools, it is time to understand the skills that you require to kick start as a UI UX designer. You need to start with fundamentals. Learn design principles, why contrast is important, alignment of the design elements, white space management and hierarchy. Beside this, you should study user psychology. It means you understand the target audience. How will they interact with the product? whether it's a website or an app. What are their needs? Will you be able to solve their problems through this product or not? The next thing you should learn is wireframing. It helps you build user flows. This will fundamentally set the foundation of the final product. Once you are clear with the user psychology and needs, it becomes easier to structure a wireframe. So what exactly is wireframe? Basically a visual layout of a digital product, maybe a website or application. It shows the structure but not the style. You need to design it in black and white without any colors, images or typography. Wireframing will help you outline the components of the product, like where you need to place the headers, buttons, images, text, etc. Wireframe helps you focus on the functionality of the product. 
so you can solve usability problems early before pixels even come into play so this sounds simple right another thing that you need to include in your learning process to work on small projects these can be passion projects or a speculated one you can also redesign existing brands and give them your personal you can start with landing pages home pages sign up process and more it can be a website or an application these small projects can become a part of your portfolio that you can easily share on behance dribble or even directly to the clients for passion projects you can get generated briefs from chat gpt or fake clients or even good brief these were simplified approach for self learning process moving ahead to the execution plan this is a simple road map or timeline that will help you to kick start your career as a ui ux designer just within 6 months so for the very first 2 months you need to focus on learning the basics of figma the core design principles and wireframing you can easily use some of the free platforms like youtube skillshare and coursera while doing this process you just have to start the work without overthinking then within the next 3 to 4 months you have to start working on the real case studies you can choose 2 to 3 projects they can be redesign or personal ideas or maybe community challenges you can find out these challenges on various free websites or even on instagram this time you need to focus on the process not perfection understand the workflow the researching part designing and then finally submitting the process now within the next 5 to 6 months you will have enhanced your skills and your project quality this time you can share your projects on behance linkedin dribble or even on twitter people will start noticing your work your visibility will improve and in turn it will build credibility after the completion of 6 months of working you will be able to apply to various companies or get any internship maybe a freelance gig or entry level job for ui ux designer your case studies will be your currency your portfolio will help you show the visuals or designs or ideas that you will be executing in your work in 2025 you don't need to have a specific design degree to get into the field just curiosity consistency and feedback this is an amazing year to start designing brands are looking for some thoughtful strategic creatives you can be one if you want more step by step videos of ui ux designing branding building your design career make sure to add your request in the comment section or if you own a business and are looking for some ui ux design services we can help you turn your ideas in stunning and functional interfaces so let's design together this is dolly solanki signing off